that is all ready. We can get the versus screen ready. So when we make videos, we know where to edit, start cutting, autopilot, uh, as we know, plays Pika, Kirby, and Falcon sometimes, at least that's what I know the plan as. And Krovi is the Falcon of all Falcons. So <laughs> Krovi is a very, very strong Falcon. Too strong. Switch on over. Get this game going here. Also gonna add this over on his BAM. Character profile. Correct flags for everybody. Free for all Pikachu! Oh! Autopilot going straight to Pikachu. Okay. Free for all. Oh. Not wanting to do the Falcon Ditto? Nope. I guess not. Krovi is very, very refined in the Falcon Ditto. Yeah, I imagine so. Um, a lot of Falcon mains don't really enjoy the Falcon Ditto, is what I have been told by a lot of other Falcon mains. Kind of true. I myself am a Falcon Ditto lover. And we're going to see the... Ooh, immediate attempt at the Falcon Punch Tech Chase. Not going to be landing right there. He's going to go for the forward air. Not going to connect anything off of it. Autopilot doing a decent job of trying to land that edge guard. Nothing going to connect. This is going to be a tech chase into F smash. Pretty solid punish from Krovi. Let's see how he deals with the invulnerability. Just going to play around the side. Does get hit by an up air, but it's low enough percent that it still doesn't matter. The raw F smash in neutral. Really good DI from Krovi on the forward air. Kind of threw Autopilot off there a little bit, it looks like. Ooh, you hate to see the SD from Autopilot there. Uh, this is going to be an up air from Autopilot into an edge guard situation. We're doing a good job of regaining center stage, reconnecting Nair into up smash, up air, down air, another stock, four stocks, one. Very tough comeback situation. Obviously, Krovi's a very experienced player. Uh, getting any stocks here would be good for autopilot. Uh, of course, silly thing to say because <laughs> that's the objective of the game. <laughs> yeah, push him off. He's gonna Kill be, him. he's gonna be, he's gonna be playing around center stage pretty well. But this is going to be another punish opportunity for Krovi, and that will close it out. The quick four stock, unfortunately. Krovi putting on, yeah, really good movement. That's what I really know Krovi for. Just this quick movement. He's got like really smooth movement. <laughs> Up and down, fast falling. Yeah, I'm a huge fan of um, Kirby's platform movement. I think it's really cool. Oh, he is going to Ditto. The Falcon Ditto. All right, here we go. So, going to be going real hard for this initial grab or initial up smash, as we see right there. So the first combo. Uh, misses the tech twice, Krovi reacting to it, just real standard up airs into up B, finishing off the first stock. Mm -hmm. Hitting right to the ledge, so this is a lot of, ooh, the down tilt, good reaction from Autopilot though. That forward air gonna be a really hard thing to get a follow up on uh, with a player uh, with DI as good as Krovi's. He's gonna throw him to the ledge, Krovi playing off of the ledge pretty decently there. That is gonna be an up air into up B, this should be a kill for Autopilot right here. Just has to close it out on the ledge, the easy peasy holds the ledge. Three stocks to three stocks. Autopilot going to go to the ledge and play off of it here. Roll up onto stage immediately upon release. Uh, does a pretty good job. Ooh, Krovi hitting with the accidental reverse uh, up air right there to send him forward. Uh, does hit the up smash in neutral into up air into up B. That should be a wrap on that stock. Really explosive matchup, obviously. We're one minute in and we've seen quite a few stocks taken. Ooh, interesting mix up there by Krovi to go for the down tilt into the up smash, reading that uh, autopilot would go for the dash in like he did before. Misses the <laughs> Falcon Punch Tech Chase, second time that he's gone for it in this set. He's going to hit the back air trade right there. Does Autopilot does manage to finish that stock off. Two stocks to two stocks. Definitely going a lot better for him than the Pikachu game. Yeah. Goes for the grab center stage. Ooh, see those forward airs? They're really, really hard to connect with uh, anything afterwards against really good DI. Mm -hmm. Goes for the forward smash. Not really going to get anything off of it. Oh, does manage to actually probably take the stock right here. Yeah, I know. I can, Let's I go. Autopilot, Auto Autopilot may be yeah. able to take the game here. Honestly, when I play him a lot of the Falcon does, he does take games off me, but it's like surprises me because <laughs> i like to think i am good at the falcon ditto and then he comes and there's like a pretty easy combo on me 
Oh, oh yeah. Just I'm, like right now? Oh, oh no, the DI. No, see that? That forward air is, it's going to be really, really hard to connect forward airs against a player uh, with a uh, high level DI. Yeah. That is going to be a real basic combo, and Crowy should close it out right here with an edge guard. But he is going to get up beat, probably letting him back on the stage. Up beat again, right back into neutral, too high percent. Oh, oh my god, he goes for the Falcon kick, kick immediately, oh, and, the, and the sneaky ledge grab. Yep. Wow, that was a pretty good one. That was a great way to end it. That awesome. was a very dramatic game. Definitely. Great on auto pilot almost taking a game off Crowby too. Yeah, definitely. Really, really back and forth for sure. <laughs> Hello, uh, um, SSB64 mount channel. <laughs> um, definitely really good to point out right there, though. It's really important that you compensate for your opponent's DI. Crowby mm -hmm. has really, really strong DI. Um, you want to be really, really careful that you don't... Uh, give him too many opportunities to DI out, right? Yeah. Forward air is something that gives you two hits, um, and they'll be DIing to begin with. And if you have really strong DI, if you're yeah. throwing out that forward air, there's a really, really good chance that somebody's just going to teleport behind you, right? Especially if Very both true. hits hit. They're going to teleport behind you. They're going to be really far in front of you. It's going to be really hard to connect that. Um, in the Falcon Ditto, this is why, you know, a lot of the choices for people has... Um, changed to more of a you know grab at zero percent down air or mm -hmm. grab at zero percent into re-grab yeah. or even into up air or single hit forward air you know things that minimize the enemy's opportunity to di out right very true so i know i said that these matches were best of five but unfortunately these guys played a best of three before they could reach to me in the middle of the tournament so i asked them if they want to just keep it a best of three they can they're more than welcome to also play out the other match I guess so they played a best of three. Yeah, they played a, a, a best it. of three. So that will be okay. the end of there. Kobe taking it 2-0. Uh, great showing, you know? <laughs> I think mm -hmm. this is why the video is still playing for me because they're asking me. And I think I was in the middle of a Chocolate Mario match. So Okay. <laughs> Call it just mishappen time, but these things happen. I think uh, after I start getting more than 12 other participants, I might have to just sit out. So I can just focus on organizing. But then I don't get the play. <laughs> I think it's definitely doable. Yeah. Just make sure you. I like the. You I know. like how I give myself an hour for the stream to play and for matches to play. I think that's a smart decision. I have to start earlier though. Just. I would say just make sure you repeat everything more than you think you need to. Right. True. Very true. These matches are best of five. These are the rules. This is what we're doing. Mm -hmm. Keep repeating it, even if you sound annoying to yourself. You know. Oh, I've I've managed people. I know. I, I don't care how annoying I sound. Uh, <laughs> for sure. It's like, oh, is that? Ooh, shut up. Do the work. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're gonna have uh, hooded versus chocolate Mario here in the uh, losers round three. This is a, a best of three as well. Losers round four is gonna be best of fives. So this will be the right last on. best of three we are gonna be seeing right now. Uh, okay. From this point on, I just need to get the scoreboard ready here. Uh, da, da, da. Okay, yeah. Hooded is player one. So it looks like we.